I, I see things and I see them instead of trying to change the methods they don't they maintain the same tactics but it's okay because things I mean it's okay that it's, it's still gonna um, I'm still gonna be impacted by those methods they do but they're very systematic so systematic and my, my brain being so calm it's even becoming more and more and more and more easy to uh, to create this this illogical ways of trying to prove themselves. I've said that many times. They use any moments to try to put doubts in you. Any any ways doubt in you. Um, and as you can see, the re reason why I'm using this person's uh, picture is this doctor talks about gaslighting right gaslighting is a method to prove to, to the target individual that this false reality is, is is real and they use different methods and to try to bury this person once the, the individual submit to this false reality submit to this bs you know they are buried into this like false reality and since i'm not subscribing i'm not submitting to this they're going to use everything to try to put down into me. Uh, this is a tactic used to gaslight you, to make you accept this false person. One moment they just use right now. It's something that is kind of, it's, it's, it's obviously not something I would, even with my regular brain, with my brain, see this as logical. It would just be nonsensical. It's so, okay, whatever. Just that That's just not going to make me subscribe to these nasty things. So they use work and moment of work. And sometimes they create these things. You know, because you're a target individual, you're going to be naturally be suspicious of your employee, your employers, right? Matter of fact, I know I don't need to be suspicious. I know they're involved. They've clearly said that they're involved in so many fashion, right? In so many fashion, they've said, you know, you're going to die. Wait till you get, you know, we're going to, they're going to frame you. They, they, they say, hey, I'm going to get raped and they're going to be told. Like they, they say, literally say that. So there's not even a suspicion. It's just, you know, that your employer are involved in your targeting one way or another. And they do things to stress you out, to not even stress you, they involve in your targeting the way they should be as a perp, right? They do things, they, they distract you when you will try to focus, like this is the norm. This is what they're going to do. So as it's natural to always be suspicious of your employer, right? But what's happening now is, they're also creating thoughts to then later on try to use that as like you see you thought this was going to happen you thought they were doing this but you see you always blame us for the things that, that you know that aren't you should be blamed to to us uh and just like the pedophilia manipulations the pedophilia things that you're experiencing is you try to blame us for what you actually naturally experience right when you obviously know that and you've been validated by anthony Green, that not only you know yourself to know that okay this is not you know this is not even something to be even uh suspicious about you know you're not yourself anymore you know you're being manipulated to think in this way but they're trying their best to do everything to to get you to subscribe to it matter of fact as i'm making this video i'm seeing ping this is part of it now one specific example i'm, I'm going to say that and it's a little bit pushed in the, into the into their uh into my brain and it's funny because actually i was glad that this thing was not even true because it, it's better for me i was oh, actually i was I, I was i would be happy to be like oh my gosh thank god i don't have to do this extra steps i can get there like it's actually a, a good thing but they had me they have this thing right where i'm supposed to send this kind of things in on a monthly basis but sometimes I don't see it, sometimes I've seen it, you know, and I don't remember and I don't think that it was sent to me by my manager, usually it's sent every month, but I, I don't remember, remember seeing it. And in my in my regular mind, right, if they didn't push me to think like that, I'll be like, oh, okay, yeah, they should probably forget, you know, it's just like it's so many, like, emails and whatever, if one month is missed, that's that. But because I'm already on this, and the level of paranoia in regard of I know my employer is involved. I was like, maybe they want me to do the extra. That's how they start making me think. Maybe they want me to do extra stuff. Maybe make me not send. Like they they go into that, and I I don't take those stuff seriously because to be honest, I could easily get this thing that I need somewhere else. It would not take me that much. 
it's just an extra few steps, but it's not, it's not something that would do anything real, you know, I would easily find this information somewhere else without having to, to get to, to, to that email. Uh, and they were trying to, to make me think that this is because, you know, that, you know, that, but at the same time, I do have a paranoia, but this is like, it's just too minuscule. So I, let me say, I know my employer, my managers, and everybody I'm working with are involved. There's no doubt. They've done things to make me, and they're doing things that I don't even know yet, that to, 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 to mess with me, to ruin my career, if, if, if even that matters at this point. So I know they're doing this. Now, this specifically, no, because that would be not ruin if it's just, it's an extra step that will do something, uh, no, it will not take me much. So, they, they forced me to have these thoughts, right? And then, and I was like, kind of like, oh man, I, I, you know, I don't want to do the extra step, you know, I hope, you know, I, I truly hope that it was sent because I don't want to go and send a message and, you know, it will take a few, few more time, but a few more minutes, but it's not, it's not hard to, to get it, right? Um, so then uh, I get the email and I see for this month I see that this that this for information sent to me for this month, right? And then they give me a thought which is a thought I should have used it before. They make me think, oh, just Google. I mean, just search uh, and see if those emails were, you know, if there's more. And I was truly hoping that I was wrong. I was truly hoping that. She sent it, I just didn't see it. That was really my hope. I truly hope, in this case, that it's just something I didn't see. Right? This is my, how my real, I would really think. I, I was hoping that this thing that she sent on the monthly was sent, but I did not see it. Because I did not want to do the extra step, right? So I, I search it and I find it. I was like, oh God, thank you, God. I didn't say, oh God, thank you, God, but I was, there, I was happy. Like, okay, I don't have to go and do this and that to get this. I can just find, use this one here. It's much faster. I'm, I'm glad. But what they try to do is like, oh, you see, you, you, you're coming up with these things, right? And you're kind of blaming her. And then you see, so that, that, there's these things that you're experiencing today. You're blaming us when it's just you. You see how they try to change this moment, which to be honest, I was actually, I was a, uh, not a happy moment, but I was, I was, you know, thankful that I didn't have to do the extra. It was not extra work, but it was not a lot of extra work, but it was just, um, it's there. I don't have to go and talk to some person to give me this, you know, it's faster this way. So I was actually happy to see that. I was happy that the issue was I didn't see it, which at this point, you know, me having focus is just, it's just so hard, right? This is the result of being continuously distracted, manipulated, and tormented. So, Things are going to be hard for me to see. This is why when I searched this thing, I was glad I saw this thing. Right? I don't know if that makes sense. But I was glad that I didn't have to do the extra steps needed if I had to. I was glad for that. Right? And so, what they use this moment is they try to make me feel like, oh, you see, you, you, you were thinking, no, no. First of all, I know those, those, you know, they, they can't, they can make me imagine certain things. They they can make me imagine, you know, the reality is I will think that oh, maybe she just didn't, that, that, that's what I would think. She probably just didn't send this time. I can easily go get it. That's that's how I would naturally think. The way they they try to make me think of it is like, no, you, um, she, she she was doing that because she wants you to do this. And that's like, no. Like that, that's the, 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 those bad thoughts that they kind of create. Or they try to make me think of because of the paranoia, knowing that these people that I'm working for are perps. Right? And so you hear them just being quiet. And tell me, are you going to be castrated? Right? Try to go with this. Way. It's like, listen, you have actually validated me. No. I've said these things many times. And they, they you know, they're going to try to find ways to be doubtful. If I can say this in a rational way, in a logical way, you understand that I'm not going to let you live your fantasy. Let me say this. My employer is 100% involved in my perp, in my, in my perping. I don't know if it's a word, in my targeting, I should say. As a target individual, I'm forced to experience disturbing things, disgusting things. 
peripheral type of tormenting, non-stop manipulations, non-stop uh, distractions, non-stop thought manipulations of all sorts. Specifically peripheral type, they make me think of this, manipulated in, in the nth degree. Now, of course of that, because of that, this also makes it hard for me to function. On top of being radiated and everything, not being able to sleep properly, it makes it hard for me to be focusing, right? So, of course, I'm going to, it's going to be harder for me to see things that are there. Matter of fact, they can manipulate me to see things that, don't, um, that, that are there, but I'm not going to see. But just based on the level of distraction, the level of manipulation, it's hard for me to function. That's that. Then, um, because... Because of, of this manipulation, it will be easy for me to not see things that are there, right? I will, I'm, I'm overwhelmed, bombarded, hard to function. So an email like that, even if it was sent, I'll be okay. Don't, I won't think twice about it and, and maybe they don't even see it or, uh, or forget about it. My memories are basically destroyed, right? So, of course, it's easy for me to miss an email to not see something or even to forget that something was sent matter of fact my memories are destroyed and these people are taking advantage of those moments to try to create thoughts of some sort which i have many times like not too long ago there's so many thoughts sometimes they take them to say about our water and they i'm thinking oh they do this thing my, 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 about my water and then and, and, and you know like this is speculation that I don't know if it's true but I'm sure that I'm being forced to think in this way because in certain ways I'm being forced to think in this ways and that's that now every moment like this where and they're going to try to force those moments many times it's, it's natural to find to be uh, paranoid in an environment where you know people are harming you in one way or another try to make you accept these manipulations it's natural to think in a paranoia way because it's not actually paranoia. These people actually are involved in your targeting. But this moment specifically is a moment that I'm actually I was glad that it's me not looking properly versus a, a, a her not sending. I was glad because I didn't want to do the extra work of getting this information. So I was like, this is like, oh God, thank God, I did, I did this is something that was there, but uh, thank God. I didn't say thank God, but I was like, I'm glad. This makes actually my job easier than do the extra. So I was glad of that, but they tried to be like, oh, you see, you, no, no, you are doing this pedal theater things to me. It's non-stop. You make it hard for me to function. This is why I'm, I'm going to make more errors. You manipulate me. You they distract me. Every second, I have to make a reality check about something. I can't even, I can't even look at a child's forehead without you guys doing these disturbing things. Of course, it's going to affect my work. Of course, the way I'm being tormented and tortured and manipulated is going to be affecting my work. Yes, you're doing this to me. You, you people who target men, women, and children, doing the perfect type of torture, to do radiate people using direct energy onto people. You who are experimenting with human beings. With these manipulations of all sorts, including the mind manipulations, are making, are doing the same thing to me and make it hard for me to work. No, I'm not perfect in the sense that I'm in the sense of work. I will sometimes not look at things, uh, not see things there. But you make it even harder for me to function. If I ever had issues with seeing, like with organizations or with details, now it's even harder than ever. You make a person hard to function because you torment them in so many disturbing pedophilia ways. Now, do, do, do I think my employer is involved? Yes, my employer is 110% involved. Matter of fact, the day I was hired, I was told in certain ways that I was a target individual. I was a, 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 uh, a, a you know, they were going to involve themselves in it. They say that all the time. They make sure that I clearly understand that they're doing it. Right. Yes, my my even my managers are involved, but yes, they they also try to create thoughts to go there. Now I don't take a lot of those talk, thoughts seriously. It's just thoughts that go in my head. I don't think it's really true. I don't think that they really. But I just let it go. It doesn't matter. I don't care. 
it, it, no, it doesn't fix it. I know in reality, most likely this person did not send it because they, they didn't, you know, it's just one of many invoices, sorry, m many things they had to, 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 to send. And I'm sorry, uh, the, that word I just said was said to me a few days ago because I think that's, that's how they wanted to gaslight me. So that's what kind of, you know, stopped there because it was kind of funny that this is what they think that's going to make me subscribe to this page for type of torture. Now, I never going to subscribe to it. Of course, I should be on guard because my employer is involved and they are involving themselves in my tor tormenting. Yes, they want me to subscribe to this page for type of torture. Yes, those thoughts that they may be doing this, this, this is just them kind of forcing it. But there's also a, a, a level of being aware that these people are going to do things to manipulate me. Are going to do things to, to make me be frustrated. And so these people are going to try to use any moment like that to make me subscribe to their peripheral things. I will never subscribe. You do this peripheral type of torture. You're forcing me to experience this disturbingness 24-7. 24 70 right before I even started getting on the computer they start to do some disgusting things and yes you're going to torture me too for the theater purposes this torture they're doing to me which is the torture that they do to a lot they're going to do other torture like they've done they radiated the torture the, the, but they're also going to try to create a theater they're going to do some disgusting things just like they've done to others but they're going to do other things in order to, to try to present themselves as we're, you know, we're just avenging, we're just mad. You know, we just, for all the things we've done, these people who torture women and children, who do the perfect type of torture, who, who makes somebody hard to function as a human being, hard to function working, are going to do whatever they do to, and, and, and try to create a theater where they're going to use torture to create this fantasy of theirs, these people are pedophiles. These people are pedophiles in the sense that they manipulate people to think in these pedophile ways. Not only that, they torture children sexually, but not only that, the people running these agencies are filled with pedos. And you, a day in a day, are trying to be gaslight you. They gaslight you to get you to accept these things. And as I'm saying that, the things they say, he knows. Right, it's a, it's a condescending way of saying, oh, he knows, right? He, he knows what, the, what, um, that I know what's happening. Or they're saying, oh, he knows the person who's, who's going to torture you. He knows who you are. He knows that you're experiencing these things. He knows all the, he knows that you're a pedophile, right? It's another way to try to gaslight you to accept this false persona. So I'm a target individual. You gotta understand. These people are going to do everything possible to get you to accept these things. Whatever things goes into your head. However, they try to manipulate you. Understand this is a ta tactic to make you accept these things. This is why I find myself almost like almost a genius at this point. Not because I th actually think I'm a genius. It's because they systematically think, do things the same ways. How many times have I said that? That they try to say, oh, you see, you thought this was going to be, then you see that, that's not us. It's the same system. It's the same tactics. It's gaslighting methods to get you to accept these things. It's going to happen again. Matter of fact, I try to now like try to stop them. Even though stop doesn't buy, like I usually don't give cares like oh, it goes good, whatever, right? I don't take those seriously. Before I was like whatever. It's not anything perfect centric, but it's like oh, this person is doing this because of this this. It's like okay. Now I try to stop it, knowing. That they try to use that as saying, oh, you try to blame me, blame, blame us for this. But the reality is like, no, you try to force me to, to think this way. But at the same time, I know with being aware that these people are doing things to, to destroy my, my life, right? In one way or another, I'm going to let those thoughts go. Because it's only natural that somebody who's trying to torment you is, might be doing things to torment you. But now, I, 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 the, the tactic is so systematic that I try to stop them. Because I don't know what they're going to do. They're going to be, oh, you see this nasty thing you just experienced? That was just you. Stop blaming us. So I'm a target individuals. There's so many ways they're going to try to make you suffer. Know who you are. And know that these things that they make you experience is what they do for others. You're not on the, the only one. If you ever have even doubts, go see a, a testimony of some random person that you've never heard of. 
they ever talk to saying the exact same things as what you're experiencing. And you understand that these people, no matter what facade they try to create, they are just the trash, the dogs, these agencies use to force people to accept this disgusting manipulation of their mind. So stay strong and know that justice will be done.